Hey folks, Martin here, and I just wanted to show you a quick little tip of how I have decided to change my corner rounding technique. So here's my Kadumaru Pro uh, corner rounder, which will be the tool that we'll be using for this quick demo. And here are some uh, laminated print and play cards from the Iron Helm uh, print and play. These are plot cards, and as you can see, they haven't been rounded yet. So my previous technique was I would take a card with unrounded corners, and I would select my size. So as you know, the Kadumaru Pro has three sizes, small, um, which is about three millimeters in radius, uh, medium, which is about uh, five, five or six millimeters, I want to say, and then large, which is uh, eight millimeters. And um, so for cards like this size, poker size, uh, 2.5 inches by 3.5 inches, I generally choose the uh, S or small size. And what I used to do is I would lay the Kadumara Pro flat on the table, insert the card, and then kind of do it like this, which took a lot of effort, as you could probably hear. Oh, okay, and that one was a miss, miss round. So this takes a lot of effort. Um, and you can also uh, kind of tell that the table, uh, my desk, is actually uh, being pushed downward with the force of my pushing down uh, on the lever of the Kadumara Pro. Uh, but we did get our rounded cards, but the amount of effort involved was pretty high, I would say. Um, so uh, I just generally uh, recently started changing my technique. Uh, rather than having the Kadumara Pro flat on the table, which is kind of what you might expect to do, or like the intuitive way of doing it, I experimented with actually picking it up and then having the uh, side that I'm rounding facing upward and then inserting the card like this. So that kind of gravity is uh, holding the card down and the corner uh, close to the, uh, the blades uh, inside. And then just go, there you go. Right. And now we've got the uh, corners rounded with the Kadumara Pro lifted up like so and not actually laying down on the table. Uh, there's uh, much less effort involved to round each corner. Uh, there's no kind of pushing down on the table. There's no kind of me having to kind of exert more force on the lever. And I'll just do it one more time. Woo! And sometimes they tend to jump out like that, which is kind of fun. Right. All right. So um, I am presenting this technique of lifting up the Kadumara Pro and kind of having the cards um, uh, inserted like a tower and using gravity to kind of hold them in place here while you exert a little less effort. You can basically not have to use the, the palm of your hand, but rather you can um, uh, use the force in one uh, finger, your thumb, and, um, you know, just so I don't get my one thumb tired, I try to, I like to help with the other thumb and just do that. And I think that that's a, especially if you have to round a lot of corners as I do today, um, I have to round, I don't know, in the order of 750 corners for to finish this, this set of cards here. Um, it's going to save you energy and it's going to um, make it less, you, know, you have to expend less energy to be able to um, round a lot of corners. So that is my pro, my quick pro tip for the day for rounding your corners with your Kadumara Pro. Um, lift it off the table and insert the cards like a tower uh, standing straight up and down and let gravity kind of hold them in place and use one thumb or two to um, just press the lever. Okay, this has been Martin and we'll see you on the flip side.